Hello YouTube, my name is Bowtie Media, and today we are doing a Daft Punk discography bracket. It's going to be a ton of fun. We have got 100 songs. 100 songs. It is a crazy big bracket. It's almost double the size of the Tristam and the Porter ones that we did earlier. So this is going to take some time. The way it's going to work is we're going to listen to 15 second segments of every song and then you get to quickly vote on them. And so this was obviously a live stream that was happening earlier. And so if you wanted to be a part of that, stay, uh, come figure out the times. I kind of switch it up every week, but it's either Monday or Tuesday. Uh, and just figure out, stay subscribed to the channel if you want to be around. But the way it works is uh, I have every 100 um Daft Punk songs into a giant bracket that is seeded. Uh, so one more time is number one, and you can see that like number two, Instant Crush. Uh, and the reason, the way it's uh, ranked is by Spotify Plays. It's not a perfect formula, but I think it just works just in terms of, you're not gonna get Instant Crush and get versus Get Lucky the first round. You're not gonna get Harder, Better, Faster, Stronger versus One More Time in the first round. It has some semblance of, of what songs are better, quote unquote. Uh, but in the end, to find the single greatest, the GOAT Daft Punk song. Without any further ado, let's hop into it. Here is our first matchup. Uh, two tracks from the 2007 Alive. Uh, this is Face to Face and Short Circuit versus Human After All. Together, one more time, music sounds better with you. Here we go. Uh, there we go. Our first round is done. Human After All takes it, the encore track. We are in our final fourth of the side of the bracket. Uh, here is Rollin' Scratchin' versus Defunk versus Dafton and Dafton Direct. Here we go. Can Rollin' and Scratchin' actually come out on top, or is Defunk versus Dafton Direct gonna take it instead? Uh, technically, like it's 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 Rollin' and Scratchin' a song from Homework versus a mix from Homework. So it's and then it'll go up against Around the World, which is the number one song from Homework. And so it's just it's all a big <laughs> Homework mini tournament here. Uh, but, oh no, <laughs> oh no, I think Daft Funk, <laughs> Daft Funk and Daft and Direct is going to take it over Rollin' and Scratchin'. I'm sorry, Rollin' and Scratchin', but that's the way the cookie crumbles. <laughs> uh, as Daft and Direct does get a second life, that is true, so, um, my, I'm sorry. <laughs> We've got... <laughs> Big oof uh, for um, for Roland and Scratchin. I have died. Yeah, Roland and Scratchin. I'm sorry. You have to change your name now to Defunct slash Daft and Direct. Um, <laughs> up next, we've got the game has changed versus Sea of Simulation. Okay, while we vote to this, can can we just appreciate something? Can we can we appreciate something? Defunct Daft and Direct in the chat changed his name. Uh, it was. <laughs> <yeah>. <laughs> <laughs> it was, uh, uh, well, Roland, his name was Roland and Scratchin', uh, but he lost a Daft Funk Daft and Direct, so now he's Daft Funk Daft and Direct. That is dedication, and I, I love the dedication. I, I love the dedication. Um, so I guess maybe you'll have to change your name. <laughs> you'll just, I guess in the end you're just gonna have the name of, of the, the number one song. I think that's just, that's how it's gonna work, right? Uh, but, uh, for now... <laughs> That's brilliant. We are moving on to the round of 64. We are finally done round one, and we have 64 songs left. We have eliminated a whopping 36 songs uh, as we are now moving into the round of 64. So as a quick recap, what do we have left? We've got one more time. This big mix here. Revolution out of nine. Superheroes. The game of love. Emotion. Within. Robot rock. Oh yeah. Night vision. Beyond. Prime time of your life. Digital love. The grid. Son of Flynn. Superheroes mix, doing it right, lose yourself to dance, alive, motherboard, Tron Legacy, titles, <laughs> Veridius Q, or how to say, whoever you say that, fresh, aerodynamic, the brainwasher, television rules the nation, face to face, television rules the nation again, Daft Funk, Daft and Direct, High Life, Crescendals, Discord, Harder, Better, Faster, Stronger, and then the other side, I know, there's so many songs, so many songs, oh wait, I pulled this over, so many songs, Get Lucky, Prime Time of Your Life mix, End of the Line, Solar Sailor, Touch, Teachers, Voyager, One More Time mix, Aerodynamic remix, Technologic, Phoenix, Giorgio by Marauder, <laughs> The Game of Has Changed, Around the World mix, Daft Funk, Daft and Direct, Around the World again, Something About Us, Finale, Contact, Touch It, Technologic, Give back, Life Back to Music, Fall, The Rezzed, Recognizer, Too Long, Fragments of Time, Short Circuit, Robot Rock, Make Love, Human After All, Clue, and Instant Crush. Woo! That is a lot of songs. So let's just hop into it right away. Uh, where we just gotta go. There's so much. Yeah, there's so much stuff. So uh, let's just let's keep going. Uh, Game of Love versus Emotion. Here we go. 
the 80th seed in the tournament may immediately upset a song that got a buy. And it's going to. It is going to immediately dethrone the game of love. Emotion is going to take it. Oh my gosh. Way to go, Emotion. You're torn? Come on, you can't be torn, Rigged. Our opinions are not lining up right now. You can't, like, I mean, they're good songs, but, like, like, come on. Like, this is, we're talking digital love here. We're talking digital love. My personal favorite Daft Punk song. One of my favorite tracks of all time, so I'm I'm quite biased to this one. Um, I'd like to see Digital Love go all the way, um, but it is going to win this round. Doing It Right wins by one singular vote. Okay. Very, very, very close. Uh, up next, we have got Motherboard versus the Tron Legacy end titles. I think this one actually is going to be pretty close. Uh, this one is close. Uh, we have got Motherboard uh, and Tron Legacy end titles. Um, 16 votes are in, and Legacy end titles is going to be up by two votes, I think. This is going to be tough. Dark Type says it's the best song on RAM, and it might be losing to the credit sequence of a movie. Oh, no. And I think it is. I think that's it. Oh, gosh. Two more votes. It is one vote difference. At one minute, I'm going to hit and pull. What's going to happen? Mother. Oh, gosh. Oh, no. I hit it. Oh no, I, oh gosh, I, I am a, I, I have to stick by my word. I have to stick at my word that I said earlier, even though I voted Tron Legacy, I have to stick by what I said earlier. And that was that if there was a tie, I would give it to the higher seat. So I'm sorry, but I have to stick by my word. I'm a man of my word and motherboard is going to take it. Bull. Uh, oh, wow. High Life came back. Not going to lie, I saw an update and I immediately hit end poll because I, <laughs> I got too trigger finger happy. But uh, in the end, it is going to be High Life with a late comeback. Whew, okay, okay, okay. I I liked both tracks, but okay. I mean, the winner was going to have to go out and play harder, better, faster, stronger anyway. So, um, yeah. I'm working, I'm up, 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 working, up, up, make it, up, do it, best to make the stronger, up, 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 work. Do you actually, okay, so here's a fun question. I'm gonna do this now. So here is, uh, here's my vinyl. Here's my very, uh, here's my vinyl for Ram. Uh, do you guys, without, without looking it up, do you know what the lyrics are to the middle of Instant Crush? Like, what is the chorus? Okay, so let's let me read it out. It's just such a weird song. Yeah, so the chorus of one of the songs is uh, one thing I never uh, see the same when you're around. Uh, I don't believe in him. His lips on the ground. Uh, I want to take you to the place in the Roche, uh, but no one gives us time anymore. Uh, he asked me once if I'd look. He, this is where it gets weird. He'd asked me once if I'd look in on his dog. You made an offer for it, then you ran off. Like, what is the like? The dog lyric is the strangest thing. He asked me once if I'd look in on his dog. You made an offer for it, then you ran off? Like what? It's like some someone's giving you, like someone's trying to buy your dog from you and then you just ran away? Like this is such a, it's such a strange lyric. It's so weird. We are done the round of 64 and we are at our top 32. We are moving along. Let's quickly see what is our top 32. We've got Get Lucky versus End of Line, Touch versus Voyager, Technologic versus Giorgio Bermuda, uh, Around the World, How to Break Faster Stronger versus Around the World, Something About Us versus Contact, Give Life Back to Music versus DeRezd, Fragments of Time, Robot Rock, and Human After All versus Instant Crush. Fun fact about this, every single matchup that should have won, won this side of the bracket. There have been no upsets. There is no one under 32 seeding that is uh that is on the side of the bracket so every if we were to just squish it down and do the top 32 so far this side is completely normal so let's just the, that whole voting and everything else there sort of didn't matter um <laughs> but uh, no it did it did it did uh because this side is where things get different i believe uh on the left side we've got harder better faster stronger versus high life defunct face to face aerodynamic veridius q uh 
A motherboard loose off to dance, doing it right. The grid, see the grid beats on the Flynn. That that's an upset. Uh, Digital love versus beyond within versus emotion, which is also an upset. And superheroes versus one more time. Wow, of the entire bracket uh, in our top 32, only two songs outside of the 32 are in our top 32. So uh, that is that surprises me. The grid and emotion have managed to sneak by and make it to the top 32 when they are ranked outside of the top 32. So, so far, this would be a very, very normal March Madness bracket if that's what was happening. But uh, here is Lose Yourself to Dance versus Motherboard. Um, I'll be shocked, actually, if Lose Yourself to Dance uh, loses, but I think it's going to. Oh, I jinxed it. Um, it is shot back up. Uh, it, had a, it had a loose mommy board, really? Um, father board. That's the stupidest and funniest thing I've heard at the same time. Um, but uh, with 25 votes, it looks like Lose Yourself to Dance is going to take it in the end. Just barely uh, beaten Mommy Daddy board. Um, so, uh, so <laughs> sorry. Okay. Around the World versus the Around the World 2007 mix. This is a good question. Do you like the original tracks better? Or do you like the intensity of the live mixes? Um, so this is, a, this is a real indicator of what you like better. And... It looks like the live mix is taking a lead. It's taking a lead around the world live. Oh, okay. This is going to be crazy. 22 votes are in, and I think that's probably just going to be it. I don't think there's any other way around the world original can win it. Wow. Okay. Around the world remix version. I mean, when you pair it with harder, better, faster, stronger, it's hard to deny it's, uh, it's star power, but... That is going to be it. Around the World 2007 mix is going to beat the original in a shocking twist of events. Dun, dun, dun. We have made it to the Sweet 16. Sweet 16 of this mega bracket. Let's see what we've got left. We have got Get Lucky versus Touch. We've got Giorgio by Around the World, Harder, Better, Faster, Stronger. We've got Contact versus Give Life Back to Music. We've got Fragments of Time versus Instant Crush. Lots of RAM. Lots of RAM. And on this side, we have got Harder, Better, Faster, Stronger versus Face to Face. We've got Aerodynamic versus Lose Yourself to Dance. Doing It Right versus Digital Love. Within versus One More Time. 10 from RAM, 5 from Discovery, and 1 from Alive 2007 with No More from Daft Club, No More from Tron, No More from... Human After All, and No More from Homework. So it is down to three final albums, which I mean is kind of expected. It's kind of expected. We knew this was going to happen. Um, these are the, the top songs, so we knew this was going to happen. We're going to have an entirely Discovery side of the bracket because, oh wow. Wait, I just realized something, guys. This is all Discovery on the left side. This is all Random Access Memories, except for the one. So if that one loses... It's just going to be straight up discovery versus random access memories. It's going to be a battle of wits until the very, very finale to see which album is truly the best, sort of. Not really actually decided that, but. What's going to happen? What? Oh! It, it changed right at the last second. Right at the last second. Giorgio wins by one vote. A vote came in the last second, and Giorgio by Moroder <laughs> will win. It is making it to the Elite Eight in a nail-biter finale. And with that, all other albums are out. It is Random Access Memories versus Discovery. That is it. You got one side Discovery, one side Random Access Memories, and nothing else, which kind of makes sense. I do get it. So we've come all this way and we've got eight songs left. We've got Discovery on the left side. We've got Random Access Memories on the right side. And these are your matchups. Touch versus Jojo and Contact versus Instant Crush are your representatives for Random Access Memories. Your representatives for Discovery are Face to Face versus Aerodynamic and Digital Love versus One More Time. This is, I think, the toughest matchup of anything else right here, personally. So let's get into it. This is One More Time versus Digital Love.
Digital Love uh, is gonna take it, I think, by a long shot, and it's not even close. 75% of the votes. Digital Love will make it to your semi finals. Still more votes for face to face. It's close. I'm gonna go, I'll wait till one minute mark on this one. Uh, 54% of the votes, and face to face has them. Can Aerodynamic come back with any more votes? I'm not sure it can. I think everyone that's voted has already voted. But if you have not, get your vote in now. Or if you've just joined, get your vote in now. I think that's going to be it. I don't think anything's changing. I'm going to hit end poll. And face to face will be your other top four contender. Oh, more votes came in, and I think Instant Crush is going to do it. <laughs> Instant Crush might just take it in the end. There may even be, oh, Contact, come back a little bit, but I think that's it. I don't think there's any way Contact is going to bring this back. I think it's just it. That is it for sure. Instant Crush will represent Random Access Memories in your top four. Touch will be your semi-finalist. And let's take a look at the bracket now. It'll be really hard to see because it's really long, but <laughs> we have got Digital Love versus Face to Face for your semi-finals of, uh, of the Discovery side versus Touch versus Instant Crush. So you've got random excess memories on the right side. You've got discovery on the left side. What is going to make it? Only you can decide, or you, us collectively can decide. <laughs> uh, but let's hop into our first matchup here. This is a digital love versus face to face. And it really is going to be digital love in the finals. It has done it. Digital love for the finals will be your representative for discovery in a not so nail biter actually that was uh that was that wasn't actually that close um but digital love will be your finalist as let's see what happens on the random access memory side we have got instant crush versus touch let's go i think instant crush is going to take it as well I don't think there's anything else. Okay. Instant crush versus touch. Instant crush will crush touch. <laughs> that, was, that was dumb. I'm actually shocked. And here's why I'm shocked. I normally, this, this is my finals. This is what I would put in the finals. If I was doing this bracket myself, I would put these two songs in the finals exactly like this. And I am, I am just shocked that it is actually ending up this way and it's not some other matchup because this is like, obviously I'm not rigging it to the fact where I would just choose me, but um, somehow, magically, the what I would pick is actually going to be in, in the finals. So before we start, I'm going to do that. I do this every time just as a, as just a thing. You need to say in chat right now, this is the most amount of people we've had here on stream why should your song win? There are some people that are on the fence. There's some people that don't know what they want to pick. There's some people that, oh, I'm not sure. I'm not sure one way or another. Why should your song win? Digital Love or Instant Crush? What is your song? Why should your song win? Put it in the comments. I want to hear it. I want to hear it. Let's just, let's see what we got here. Digital Love is groovy. Touch, you get it. Not even close. Instant Crush is bad, man. Duh, or technically rolling and scratching. Uh, my song should win because it's better. I beg of you. The synth solo in Digital Love. Digital Love is perfect. Instant Crush. Love is stronger than anything else. <laughs> That's true. Love is stronger than anything else. Oh, <laughs> Yopo. I forget. Yopo again. Thank you for the super chat. Uh, did you know that voting Instant Crush increases increases your life quality? Yes, yes, it's true. Vote Instant Crush for a better life and to end the streak of picking the losing finalist. Please, I beg of you. Yes, this is the uh, this is the third bracket we've done, uh, and Yopo has done this every time before. Thank you for the super chat, Yopo. Uh, donated, and uh, he's <laughs> he's he's done it for the wrong song twice. Uh, he's he's got the, his song has lost twice in a row. Uh, so we will see if his song can make it to the uh, to the ending or not. Um, let's see if he uh, if he really if he really intrigued you this time. So uh, let's go. Digital love versus instant crush.
don't know why YouTube does that. But uh, let's see. Oh, 26 votes. And Digital Love has a commanding and a nice 69% of the votes. Oh. <laughs> Uh, 30 votes are in at 73%. <laughs> oh no, Yopo. I, uh, <laughs> this is the third time it tragedy strikes thrice. Um, and I, uh, I think that's going to be it. It's an absolute slaughter for the finale. 31 votes. My personal favorite has won. That is the third time that Yopo has lost the final vote. And gone against what I personally voted. So this is honestly becoming a bit of a meme. Uh, Digital Love absolutely crushed. Instant crush. Uh, and Digital Love is going to be your finalist. Your winner. Way to go, Digital Love. I'm sorry, Oppo. Um, just absolutely killed uh, for the third time in a row. Uh, so you got to stop voting against me, Oppo. I, I don't tell you beforehand, but you got to stop voting against me because I voted the winner three times correctly now, and you have missed three times. Um, so tragedy has struck in, um, but uh, we still love you. <laughs> Uh, let's see, uh, where's this final bracket though? So Digital Love um, had to go through Instant Crush. It had to then beat Face to Face. Had to beat One More Time. Had to then beat Doing It Right. Had to then beat Beyond. And had to beat Prime Time of Your Life. That's a big... That's that's a that's a bit like that's a big run. Not gonna lie, like those are some of the best song. Like those are some of the best tracks for sure. Uh, so it it had a good run. It had a really good run. Um, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna get lucky next time. Get it? Yeah, that's hilarious. Um, yikes. So that uh, that is it. Digital Love is your winner. We have successfully found the greatest, the goat, Daft Punk song yet of all time. Not yet, sadly, because they're retired and dead, but not dead. Um, but uh, they're no longer a group. So, Digital Love is the best Daft Punk song of all time. <laughs>